No, Bernard and Stan and Perlita. That's your problem with dealing with me in this situation, Bernard and Ellery and, 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 you know, the group of you and Dave. No, David, there are those that believe in a concept and idea and who have the time and, and money to invest in it. And then there are those of you who will mock and make fun of it and come up with excuses all the time. Okay. Those who are willing to take a risk and who truly believe in that idea, you guys have put so much energy in into the concept of the dial, it's everywhere. Those who take the time and truly believe in that, David, in that concept, they will make that idea happen. They're willing to spend almost, they'll put their lives, devote their lives to it. And so while you guys are torturing and mocking me and tearing me down, well, Tom Bryan or liar, da, 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 guess what? For quite possibly the last 5,000 years, they've existed. And while you guys were screwing around, people devoted their time and energy to making that concept and idea happen within the last 3,000 years. So 2016 plus 3,000 gives you what, 5,000? Look at the Hebrew calendar. You know you've heard Hebrew come out of my mouth in Judah and or any of those nations and you've heard it out of your own people, Dave, whether they are poor or rich. And since you don't know the extensive history about my family, Dave, and they've seen me be mocked and ridiculed for that idea so many times, it's obvious that we've seen them. I've seen them in my sleep. Other people may have too. So those who believe in that concept and idea and probably will before I was born, who believe in it, make it happen, will be probably the most successful ones. And those who, them and they do, there's not gonna be anything you guys do to stop them. And so while Perlita and Stan and whoever else, the All-American tried to do their own, those who had a more of extensive knowledge and who truly believed versus those who treated it as a joke and tortured and stole and whatever, who do you think is going to have the best advantage? Like I said, David, I have an extensive history. Joe knows it. Other people know it. So there are those who will believe and make that concept and idea happen while you guys tear me down. Part of our, you know, and <laughs> that was something that was always a part of our heritage. They'll find out those who believe in it than those who don't. So if you're going to act like a racist hillbilly hick going poof, 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 and then, you know, Robo Knight and whoever else asserting certain people are gods and all this stuff when they're not, I was born by different, you know, all this crap that wasn't true. Those who monitor and watch it the greatest, who make that concept and idea happen and put the most research and development in it, will be the victors. So like I said, a long time ago, maybe some Israelis and stuff came to teach the Spanish Jews how to land survey on the East Coast and down here. And as they put in their work and the hillbilly hicks and them came through in the carnies, they got it, watched it be stripped out and their families destroyed. So if they invested in that, that concept and idea while they were watching the groups of you rape and torture me and do you know, cloning and socks and all that, guess what? If they truly believed in that concept and idea and they made it happen, there's nothing that you guys are going to be able to do to stop them because they essentially become the timekeeper. And if Brian did it, and then he talked to Joe down there, which I have not seen for a long time, and they became successful with another man, good luck. And if they made it work, there's nothing you're, the group of you who sat there and did all that nasty shit to me are going to ever be able to do to stop them because they will ultimately always be the rulers over the earth because they made a concept, an idea that they believed in happen, an actual reality. And most of you will never get to know what it is because that's what rules reality to them. And see, I didn't get to be a part of it. So how will I be able to evolve up with them or with anyone else? That's why if those guys come through to do what they want to do, they're going to have to kill me. And guess what? They may not want to, but they're going to have to. 
and they know they can rule over the groups of you for the rest of the eternity of the planet Earth.